Hi, this is Mike from Mike's Unboxing and Reviews and How To, and on today's video, I'm going to help you to decode your AV1 files. So, if you're one of those lucky people that has a new modern graphics card which supports AV1 encoding, you may have found that sometimes when you try to play back your videos on your Windows machine or maybe another machine, that unfortunately you're unable to actually view the content and it just shows up as an audio file. Now that is because you do not have a installed AV1 codec. Fortunately, Microsoft have got your back and there is actually a completely free of charge AV1 codec installer which you can put on your computer and therefore you can actually watch your AV1 footage. Now, of course, if you're using OBS for streaming, the AV1 encoding and decoding is done by your streaming provider. But if you're recording it in OBS and then you wanna play back as another file or send to somebody else, then of course they will also need the AV1 codec as well. Anyway, that's enough waffling. Let's show you how to get it for absolutely zero pence. So just in case you're not too sure what I'm talking about, so if you're recording in OBS or Streamlabs or any other recording software and you have the option for hardware AV1 like we have here with our AMD graphics card, you can record and everything will look fine on the screen. You'll see it, but when you come to play it back, the file will have no video, just audio. So yeah, that pretty much sucks. So what you'll need to do is to uh, actually we'll close all this down and head over into the Microsoft Store. You've probably got an icon for it down on your taskbar. And all you need to do is to go up to the top here and type in AV1. Now, there's gonna be a bunch of AV1 things coming up, but you only want the one which actually is the AV1 video extension. And you can see which one it is. This is actually from Microsoft Corporation. So, um, well, you kind of know it's legit. So all you need to do is to click on install and that is effectively it. You may find, depending if you're logged into your system as a Microsoft account, then there may be an extra step which just says, do you want to sign up for a Microsoft account? Obviously, you click no if you don't want one, and it will still allow you to install it. So once you've done that, you can click on open. It won't actually open anything, but what it will do is this is now AV1 support. So if you're using the Microsoft default video playback, then it will work absolutely fine and you can actually watch AV1 encoded footage absolutely fine and at those much reduced bit rates, but improved quality. So there you go, very simple to do and best of all, it's absolutely free. Hopefully this video has been useful to you. If it has, smash that like button. If you wanna see more content like this on a daily basis, then maybe you could consider hitting that subscribe button and also the chime notification. That way you'll be notified of future video releases. But for now, I've been Mike. This is Mike's Unboxing Reviews and How To and hopefully we'll catch you in the very next video. Oh, and it might even be AV1. Thanks for watching.